Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are playing Vacuum Simulator. There's actually been kind of a weird update to the game. We're gonna check it out. We're gonna get the brand new most powerful vacuum that they got to offer, unlock all the areas and get some brand new faces. I'm a know-it-all apparently. This is my know-it-all grin. You like that? So out here they've added an Earth 2 portal which it just seems to be a strange decision to me, but here it is, Earth 2, where you can collect chests, which go up here, and you're able to unlock new areas. This is very lazy. This is made very, very lazy. I'm actually super disappointed in this update. So the update log actually boasts that there's five new realms. So one, two, three, four, five, to explore. I'm not really exploring them now, am I? So let's run over some chests and collect a few here while I talk to you guys about the commenter of the day. Our commenter of the day today is Royal. And as I love your videos, you always make my day. Keep up the great vids. By the way, I miss Timmy. Hashtag a blue team. Thank you for such a nice comment. I miss Timmy too, but we just, we don't really do that guy anymore. We do the comment of the day instead of Timmy. Now, if you guys would like to be a commenter of the day, all you gotta do is leave a comment down below with the hashtag blue team and you'll be good to go. Does anybody know why these chests say how many rebirths are left? 192 rebirths. I don't understand what that means, but these chests say three rebirths left, right? So if I was to use a code that was update nine, it would give me three rebirths, right? It doesn't, I gained three rebirths, but this it's still had nothing changed. I don't understand what this means. Three rebirths left. What does that mean? I don't fully understand, but let's go ahead and buy a brand new vacuum. We have, how many of these do we have? We can buy the 751. Let's do that. So let's buy this guy. Range 120 multiplier 13. So let's buy that. It's now equipped. Does it, uh, does it do anything other than, well, it doesn't help with the chest. I know that much. How does it go out here? Ooh, all right. It's got a good range. What what was the range? It was 112? What's the range of the strongest vacuum here? Only 100. Okay, so at least the vacuums are an upgrade. That's cool, but at the same time, when you rebirth, you would lose this vacuum, and you need chests to buy the vacuum, not coins, so it'd be a lot harder to get more chests, right? I wonder if that means it's not worth it. We'll have to do some testing in today's vid. Let's unlock this last area here, and then we can save up a bunch of chests, like so many chesticles, and then we're gonna get 7, 000, uh, 6,750 to buy some tier four faces. And we're gonna see how good those are. It looks like I can only equip one face at a time too, so I don't have to go above and beyond. Wait, why can't I collect these now? Wait, it's not collecting anything anymore. Why is that? Do I need to rebirth three times to be able to collect these chests now or something? Um, something bad has happened. I have zero rebirths. What? Wait, what? What just happened to me? I had 3,000 rebirths and now I have zero? What? Look, I can't access any of the worlds anymore. What is happening? I lost all of my rebirths when I bought the vacuum. What is happening? Wait, let's buy this one for 250. I have zero rebirths now. I don't understand. Wait, was I losing rebirths every time I opened a chest? I am gonna have to get three rebirths and find out exactly what is going on. Okay, I have three rebirths. So can I get a single chest now? It takes away your rebirths. I didn't realize that it takes away your rebirths. Oh no, that that is not good. Uh oh, I have actually, I have just lost 3,000 rebirths without even realizing, no. Oh man, the grind to get all of that back is gonna be so fun. Can't wait. I actually scammed myself. I was not paying attention. I was too busy focusing on the video. I have made a big mistake. I am actually the biggest noob. Okay, so we need to unlock this place. We need to unlock the woods ASAP. So I was just looking at the update log and it doesn't mention anything about them taking away rebirths. So all you've got to go on is that it says three rebirths left. What does that even mean? Did anybody else get scammed by this? Please let me know in the comment section down below if you made this same mistake as me because I am very I'm actually quite upset by this this is a big deal for me that's 3,000 rebirths that have just disappeared okay let's get our bag we got our big island getaway backpack luckily let's go into the woods how much
much for 100 rebirths because I need to start earning this back. 800 mil to rebirth 100 times. Okay, that's fine. Oh, this feels like I'm starting over. Sell my stuff, please, game. All right, 14 mil for the diamond coin zapper. Now we can get 100 rebirths. We should be able to do this pretty quickly. Oh man, I don't even have access to these areas because I have no rebirths. This is so sad. Okay, I have 1.7 bill. It's still very easy to get 100 rebirths. Good. Okay, this is panic time. 100% panic time because I kind of want to just unlock the last area here, Earth 2. I would like to spend my rebirths so that I can buy some better faces and things. Like, how many do I get for one of these? Not enough. I only have 55 rebirths now. Okay, I wanted to do this, but this is going to take a lot longer than I realized. Oh, look at this. You don't lose these vacuums when you rebirth. You just have to re-equip them. That's awesome. Okay, so this is the same as the rebirth backpack shop. That's really good. I can live with that. That's amazing. So we should be able to go in here now. Yes. Okay, we're rebuilding. We're rebuilding fast. It was... I don't have 60 rebirths. Great. It was actually worth it. I'm so glad that we bought the vacuums because they make the chest stuff worth it. Cool. Can I go here? I can. Yes. All right, that should be more than enough to rebirth. All right, so just rebirthed. We would go and grab the backpack here from the rebirth shop. And then you would run into Earth 2, go vacuums, and equip this guy. Boom. Super cool. All right, I can dig it. That's actually a cool update. So it looks like a couple of other people in the server with me also have no idea why their rebirths have disappeared. This is kind of concerning. A lot of people are losing their rebirths without even realizing right now, this Magnus WW guy has just, he's spent over a thousand rebirths. He's too low now to use the big rebirth boards. I don't think he realizes. I've been trying to get his attention to warn him. He ain't responding, dude. So I have a feeling that a lot of people are probably losing their rebirths because the update log doesn't tell you and honestly, this text is vague. It is very vague and people rush into things without reading it properly. So I need a lot of rebirths to get back on top game. I need that rebirth board in there for 2,500. It looks like I'm going to be grinding a lot just to get everything back that I lost. But the only good thing about it is I'm getting rebirth gems, which I'll be able to use at the chest here once I have access. Well, guys, I honestly have to admit, I'm a little bit salty about this update that it didn't clearly state about how I was going to lose my rebirths. I'm sure that some people figured it out before I waste, like, before they wasted all their rebirths like I did, which is great. But most people don't appear to be figuring it out, and they seem to be shocked when I tell them. So, not a big fan of this update. I'm really not happy that Earth 2 looks like it took him 15 minutes to make. It is good to get rebirth versus versions of the vacuums, but I don't think it's worth the cost. Like, a new currency is cool and all, but I would have just added it maybe as a currency that you could earn using rebirth gems. You didn't need this whole chest system that makes it feel like pet simulator. Yeah, not a big fan of this for now. We'll see. I don't know. Maybe once I get the rebirth boards back, I will grind more and more and be able to get it together. But for now, I'm kind of just salty, and I think I'm going to leave this video as like a, hey, watch out everyone, because you got to lose your rebirths, because I'm sure I played this update before most people. You know, I prioritize the updates because of videos, whereas a lot of my viewers will keep playing their favorite game until they see videos on the update, and if they like it, they'll go and play it. So hopefully, a lot of you guys will see this before you play the update, and you won't lose all your rebirths to those annoying little chests. But yeah, here comes my 1500th rebirth boop. That gives me 1,500, which means I'm getting closer to a bigger rebirth board. So a thousand more to go, and then I can get access to the bigger rebirth board, start doing 1,000 rebirths at a time until I get to 10K, and then I can use a super big board, get to maybe 100K rebirths, and then spend them on Earth 2. Basically, what you need to do is no matter how many rebirths you spend on chests, you need to make sure you still have enough to access the bigger rebirth board so that you never lose the best and most efficient way to rebirth. But yeah guys, that is gonna do it for today's video. Super disappointed, but at the same time, it does give me something to grind on, so I'll play this. If you guys are unsure of the update, watch out for my next video where you can see if it's really worth it or not. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, comment down below, and of course, subscribe with those notifications turned on, and I will see you all next time.